Mafia 4 could arrive sooner than you think. Back in 2022, 2K was celebrating the 25 years of the Mafia series. But what they also leaked is that they said that a new Mafia project was in the making. Yo, what's good YouTube? My name is Scully and we're back with another video and today we're going to be going over Mafia 4. We're going to be talking about the news that they dropped and we're going to be also speaking on the hirings and the, the new game designers and the artists and stuff and also what could be added into Mafia 4. But before we continue, let's make a like goal. Let's try to reach 1,000 likes today. I know that's a tough task, but I believe we can do it. Anyway, let's continue. Now, Mafia 4 is projected to go in the year 2025. After the release date of GTA 6, a lot of games with similar playing styles are planning to release that same year. I'm hearing rumors about a Call of Duty Black Ops 2 remake, and those rumors came from a reliable source. Now, there have been a few pop-up jobs online that mentioned the Mafia franchise. They said they were looking for 3D environment artists to make organic art models and landscapes. Now, my question is, why did they need no get at models if it was set in a city? Now, in my last Mafia video, I asked the people in the comment section, where should the Mafia game be based off in? And about 80% of the comment section said Las Vegas. And I almost forgot to mention that the game is being made with Unreal Engine 5. Just to let you know, Unreal Engine 5 is incredible, bro. That shit is, that shit look insane, bro. And on one of the job listings, it mentioned that the game would have incredible stuff. So you will have the option to go silent or go in loud, like kind of like how COD do. And they also mentioned that Mafia 4 will finally have multiplayer. Now, since this is a Mafia game, I can see the multiplayer kind of like being like GTA RP, where you have like multiple crews rolling out and stuff like custom made Mafias. Now, if they have multiplayer in the game is based off in Vegas, I believe that game will have contention to be game of the year that year potentially better than gta 6 who knows only time will tell though now in my last video i made about mafia 4 i told my subscribers to make a concept what they think that mafia 4 should be about the oro door said a mafia sequel in 1975 gal gabbett a 6-1 year old protagonist as vito scaletta biological daughter trying to take over the rackets of las vegas strip clubs and las vegas for the next five to six years surpassing olivia Marcano, who is Sal Marcano's sister in Mafia 3, by becoming the first ever gangster in Mafia ranks to become the underboss of the godmother of the Sicilian Mafia family, with Gail Gabbett face in it. She'll be a great Mafia gangster, she should be in Mafia 4. I don't know who Gail Gabbett is, but that would be a W storyline, not gonna lie to you. Messi418 said a good take. He said, Imagine playing as Tommy Angelo's son and he is an undercover cop doing Donnie Brasco in 70s and 80s, Vegas. We can have a Galante crime family return and Louis Romeo crime family, Vito crime family, Freddy Clemente crime family. So four families and supporting characters is Donovan, Joe, Tony Balls, Enzo Conti, and some new characters, and Tommy Jr. Have a secret agenda against Joe and Vito. But also, but also their main agenda is to crack down the mob once and for all. Oh shit, I can see that because Tommy Angelo got killed in front of his sons. What if his son, subjectively, what he's saying is what if his son became a cop to take down Vito and Joe after they reunite? That would be crazy. It'll be a full circle. Shout out to Messi648 for that good take. All right, now it's time for my take. I think Mafia 4 is going to be based off in Las Vegas. Lincoln Clay and Vito Scaletta are still going to be teaming up. Lincoln Clay is going to tell Vito about Joe. Lincoln Clay and Vito are going to meet Joe at a bar, right? They're going to sit down and have a talk. Lincoln Clay is going to recognize Joe as being Galante's driver. Lincoln, Vito, and Vito is going to recognize him. That's how they're going to recognize him. And Joe's going to pull out his wallet to pay for the drinks, right? And it's going to have Lincoln Clay's mother on it. And that's when Lincoln Clay is going to find out that Joe his dad. Because in Mafia 3, they did say Lincoln Clay's father could have been Italian. And in Mafia 2, if you remember that one picture, Joe was in the strip club. That was a black lady, so that could be a possibility. And Joe's going to tell them that Vio Colante told Lincoln Clay that he set him up. So Joe's going to side with Lincoln and Vito. And they're gonna try to take down Galante. But I think Vito and Joe is gonna die that game. 
and somehow Lincoln's is gonna escape. I think that's just how they're gonna end. But let me know what y'all think. Type down in the comment section what type of scenarios y'all think Mafia 4 is gonna be in and how y'all think the game's gonna end. The best concepts in the comment section below gets mentioned in the next Mafia 4 video. All right, that's gonna wrap it up. Let's try to get this video to a thousand likes. And if you enjoyed the video, make sure you subscribe to the YouTube channel. We're almost to a thousand. We're halfway there. We're almost to 600. So, the more the merrier. Without further ado, it's your boy Scully signing off. Peace.